Boom! Ito na, Smart Bro Home Wi-Fi Fiber Like Speeds at home is possible na guys. Ito talaga ang hinihintay ko from Smart. This new year, mas madali na mag-level up ang ating online activities with the country's first 5G-powered prepaid home Wi-Fi from Smart Bro aptly called Smart Bro Home Wi-Fi 5G. Marami sa atin na yung walang access sa isang fiber connection kasi hindi pa siya available sa ating lugar. At saka isa pa ay sobrang mahal na isang fiber connection kapag dedicated yan, baka wala yan sa budget nyo. Kaya lang, Vince, meron na akong 5G phone. Paano yan? Baka hindi ko na kailangan yan. Well, there is a reason kung bakit meron mga dedicated devices for 5G or home Wi-Fi connection. Unang-una, meron siyang 5G+, plus mas mabilis yan sa 5G ng phone mo, which is 2NR carrier aggregation ensures more reliable 5G connections and faster speeds by utilizing two 5G channels simultaneously. At meron pa siyang Wi-Fi 6, which is nahanap na sa mga flagship phones. I'm pretty sure yung phone mo ay nag-assume lang ako, syempre. <laughs> Sobra naman. Pero most likely, Wi-Fi 6 is... Uh, Mahal ngayon. And ito, kasama na siya. Which means, kaya niyang umabot ng up to 9.6 Gbps. What? Well, up to lang naman yun. No? Iba pa rin yung actual na signal and internet na masasagap ng inyong router. That together with 6 external antennas, 9 DBI high gain antennas, gigabyte ethernet ports, meron pa siyang MIMO, meron pa siyang WPA3 Wi-Fi security. Ayun, sobrang high tech naman. Kaya let's check it out. Apo si Bins, and you're watching Unbox Diaries. Hoo -hoo. Nice box, ang ganda. Cover lang pala. Nice art design sa likod, oh. Okay. Ano na sa loob nito? Oh my goodness. Kaya pala malaki ang box kasi may kasama pa siyang. Akala ko, kahoy. Ano pala yung router or yung device? Wow. Wow. <laughs> That is crazy. Who designs a router like this? Grabe ka. If you look closely, no? Ang dami nangyayari dito. May nag-stream, nag-release ng music, nag-work from home, nag-online class. Pero ang saya-saya nila kasi ang bilis ng internet. All of them are interconnected gamit ang pinabagong Smart Bro Home Wi-Fi. Ayan, no? Sa gitna, gitna, gitna siya. I like it, ha? And it looks very stylish. And I think bagay na bagay siya sa kahit anong pwesto sa bahay. Ayan, no? So, masaya na sila lahat kasi mabilis ko na lang internet ngayon dahil kay Smart Home Wi-Fi 5G. And of course, how can we forget LAN cable, charger, yung SIM card, which is nasa loob na, and yung quick user guide. And that is pretty much it. Parang UFO ah. Yes, it does look like a spaceship. And this has got to be the biggest router I have ever reviewed for home Wi-Fi use. Pero tinan nyo naman, very compact siya no? Napaka straightforward yung design. Tataas mo lang yung mga antenas ng ganyan. And then you're good to go. Nasa loob na yung SIM, naka-sealed na yan. So hindi mo siya pwedeng galawin. And as you can see, meron siya mga LED lights dito. Wi-Fi 6, 5G, 4G, SIM, and yung system. Ang sabi ni Smart 5G yung kanyang main internet. 4G is yung backup. Which means kapag wala siyang nasagap na signal ng 5G, magpo 4G siya. And of course, Wi-Fi 6 is yung gagamitin yung Wi-Fi sa inyong bahay. Mas malawak yung range at mas mataas yung kanyang speed limit. Sa likod, meron siyang dalawang LAN port dito. If you wanna share the internet through Ethernet, pwede naman. Meron siyang WPS dito and yung reset button. And of course, yung kanyang power. Ayan. Very simple lang, no? Very straightforward. Hindi na siya nakakalito. Okay, so naseta po na siya. Ito po yung tura na yan. Naka-green si Wi-Fi 6. 5G, naka-green din. And we're using SIM card. Yes. Okay, test na natin. 5G, Smart Bro Home Wi-Fi. Konektado na. Speed test na natin. Gaano kabilis? PLDT Smart. Boom! Ang bilis. Oh my goodness. 100 Mbps. Fiber na fiber. And yung kanya upload. 21 Mbps mga ganun. There you go mga kaibigan. One word. Wow. Yan po yung speed na nasasagap po dito sa akin studio. Party dahil hindi pa ito yung the best place to get the signal. I can assure you. Pero ayun, if you get this kind of speed, nako, 4K sa Netflix, posibleng posible na. Which is dati imposible, 1080p lang ang kaya mong gawin sa mga ganito. Check na natin sa Mobile Legends. Okay, so ito po yung kanyang speed or ping sa Mobile Legends. 14 milliseconds po yan mga kaibigan. Which is okay na, no? Iba pa rin yung true fiber. Sobrang baba ng ping. Very responsive naman siya. Very consistent na. Hindi siya yung palipat-lipat na ping. Matagal siya sa 14 milliseconds. Ayan, no? 14 milliseconds pa rin. What? Yes, dapat ganito kayo maglaro. Sobrang lapit sa router. Para wala talaga yung ping. Speed-wise, parang fiber talaga. Pero sa ping, medyo mas better siya sa broadband. Siyempre, hindi lang yung Wi-Fi may ping. Meron din ping yung pagsagap ng 5G to Wi-Fi and yung Wi-Fi to the smartphone. And that causes more latency. I also tried Netflix no gumagana na yung kanyang 4K. It is now all possible. Streaming 4K gamit lang ang 5G network. Kaya lang syempre mabilis na maubos yung data if naka 4K kayo. Yun na lang siguro yung main problem no is yung data allocation. Sana lang 100 gigabyte murang-mura lang no. Para kahit 4K ang pinapanood mo hindi ganun kasakit. You would still want to watch at 1080p 
technology but the uh, possibility is endless with 5G today. Now speaking of data no, meron siyang 20 gigabytes of free data when you open the unit. Meaning pwede mo siya matest agad, you can have internet immediately after you open it. And just compared to fiber no, it's almost fiber like. Alam ko ang speed na nakuha ko sa isang broadband connection and it's not pleasant. Kadalasan malag, hindi ko magana agad yung browsing sa Facebook ko bagal din. But this one, fiber na no? It is almost as reliable as fiber mismo. Pero syempre, mas worth ako na sa Metro Manila ako. Hopefully, meron kayong 5G sa inyong lugar at masagap niyo yung 5G connection. Else, baka kasi 4G lang yung sa inyong lugar. 4G lang talaga yung lalabas dito. But yes, right now, Smart has the leading 5G technology and number of towers in the Philippines. Sila yung pinakamaraming towers na 5G, guys. Guys, konti pala yung mga tao na may 5G. 5G phones are still quite expensive. It is still not mainstream yet. So, if meron kang 5G phone right now or kung meron kang ganito, hindi pa ganun ka-congested ang net network ng 5G ni Smart. What this means is that mas maganda siya for work, for online class, kasi ngayon competition for the network is still not too much to handle. And if I were you, I would grab the opportunity. Other notable specs, no? Ito ay gumagamit na ng LTE Cat19, Wi-Fi 6, 2x2 MIMO, 5G 2NR, carrier aggregation, 9 dBi high gain antennas, and connects up to 10 Wi-Fi enabled devices. Isa pa is hindi nyo nakala mag-contract signing pa. Just by the device, wala nang lock-in period, and the internet is very accessible naman. So, ang dali pa na niya is set up, no? Gumamit lang ng the usual GigaLife app. Simply log in with the number, i-load mo lang, and you're good to go. Actually, hindi ko na siya pinaloadan kasi meron pa siyang 20 GB na free data. But if you want some more load, no? Meron siya dito mga promo, Giga Video Pro, Family Load Video Plus, meron siya yung mga pang gaming, pang social media, pang video. Maraming options to choose from. Ayun. Hindi na siya tulad dati, medyo magulo pa ngayon. The interface is so nice, so easy to use. And it's actually the most intuitive app, no? Compared to its competitors or competitor. And by the way, it supports 2NR carrier aggregation, a breakthrough feature that enables users to get wider indoor coverage and stable connection at home. Nice. Ngayon, ang tanong magkano ba si Smart Bro Home Wi-Fi? Eto yung price, no? 15,995 pesos. Okay na, okay na, no? Ang okay kasi dito, guys, is prepaid lang siya. So, ibig sabihin, no lockdowns, no unwanted data charges, at napakadali ng installation nito. Hindi mo na kailangan ng mga technician para iset up ito. Kahit sino, kayang iset up ito. O, oh, diba? The Smart Bro Home Wi-Fi can be bought at the Smart Online Store. Ah, uh, dun lang. Dun lang muna. So, check it out. Links descriptions below. Guys, kung nagbabala kayong gawing hotspot ang inyong phone, don't do it. Iinit yung phone nyo, babagal, at hindi ganun kabilis yung kanyang wifi speed or sharing. At mabilis pa maubos yung battery ng phone nyo. So, don't do it. Buy a dedicated device for sharing internet just like the Smart Bro Home Wi-Fi. Meron pa siyang 5G+, Plus, which is not available on phones. Other words, mas maganda talaga yung 5G handling ng ganitong klaseng device. And as usual, if you wanna see more videos just like this one, unboxing, reviews, mag-subscribe ka lang, hit the bell icon, so that you don't miss any of my great content. I'm Lutz Bins, and you're watching Unbox Diaries. Hoo-hoo.